Hello, hello everybody, it's Eric Fries, and I'm doing the Halloweenus Lights 2021. It's been completed, I don't think there's been much change since I made the initial video of them, but tomorrow, once I get out of work, I'm gonna come over and take all of the Halloweenus Lights down and put them in storage. Um, it's gonna be about a week until I start putting up the Quima stuff, I just have to get a hold of some more Quima lights for outside, and I'm not exactly sure what I'll do for Quima lights this year, so we'll see. Um, besides that... Um, neighbors over across the way, they still have their Quima lights on. They have, uh, one orange strand and another small, uh, LED orange strand that's multi-mode and a large purple multi-mode set that you can see. And there's a little section, actually, I'm not sure if there's a section out of it or if it's going on the other side, but they do have that really nice multi-mode set, what they have set on their combination setting, which I am partaking in right now. I really like multi-mode lights, so... Yeah, sadly I don't have anything out here that flashes. So I have the pumpkin lights here going down the side of the railing. These were a goodwill find. I th see the tag on these is still functional. Yeah, somehow it is. $2 is what I paid for these. Yeah, these lights are still working pretty good. The pumpkin lights. Um, and over here we have the LED web light that's purple. This is still working somehow. And then we have the orange web light over here. I have a thing for these web lights. I really like how they look. Um, I've not seen really many people have these. I saw at one point in time a, a smaller purple set, much like that one that was incandescent. That was the only time I saw web lights. And after that, I've never seen any of these webs. I've seen the nets, but never the webs. And I really like the webs. They're perfect for Halloweenus. And we have these eyeball lights here from the Dollar Tree. We have two of them there. We have these skull rings here. There's one here, or fence, not rings. They're fence pieces. So you have those two there. And then we have a plumpkin there and a window, which is incandescent. There is a thesis on a Intermatic programmable timer. Um, it's analog. So yeah, I have a Quima Twee looking thing that I'll put up in there. Once again, I'll probably be the first Christmas light to go up because it's going to be the easiest to do. And then window candles will be everywhere else. I'm honestly considering doing a window candle there as well as a fiber optic tree in there. We have the sparkly plumpkin here. Have the uh, family dollar timer or dollar general, I can't remember. And then we have the two solar ghosts over here from Dollar Tree. Which, the batteries on these have just been absolutely horrible. This one here is, is, die, is dead, which you can't tell really unless if I turn on the flash. You can see it there. And then there's the other one. These, I don't know if, I get an, if I'm getting enough sunlight off of them, but they are over here. Um, so that's what I have for Halloween lights as of right now. I don't really have any more, but yeah... Thank you very much for watching, and yeah, Halloween is Slice 2021.